llamas. You wouldn't expect to find them in Arizona, right? Well, Cronkite News reporter Maxine Park met up with one Chandler woman who has not just one llama, but a whole pack. Barbara Peacock keeps something special in her backyard. I'm a big guy. It's not what you'd expect to find. This is Navajo, Hopi, it's Apache, Lakota. She takes care of llamas. <laughs> Wonderful, quiet animals that had a special spirit. Barbara is the president of the Arizona Llama Rescue, taking in llamas that people have left behind. They just don't want them anymore. They bought them when they were cute babies, and they're not cute anymore. And, uh, that, and that's, that's probably the main reasons right there. At one point, Barbara said she had up to 20 llamas in her backyard, including ones like Sinbad right here, causing curious onlookers to stop and take a look across the fence. All the family down in the strollers and on the bicycles and they'd line up against the fence and of course I'd come out and give them a little talk about llamas and introduce them to everybody. And Her husband Donald says the llamas are like his wife's children. She trains pretty good. They train her pretty good too. <laughs> I've got a lot of patience that I don't think I have patients in that area so much. Barbara says her hope is to make sure every llama finds a good home. They're pretty and they keep the grass mowed and um, so what if they are yard ornaments? That's all mine are. Yard ornaments, which Barbara says have made her life richer. In Chandler, Maxine Park, Cronkite News. Very cute.